Hello, it's Andy Graham with HoboTraveler.com. I'm in Kiev, Ukraine, and I want to try to give you guys that are kind of hung up on Europe a, a way to find uh, other expats. Um, I was in Malta, I've been in many places, and I've always been asking, how do I find the center of the expat universe? In any place I've been on the planet where expats have been hanging around for a long time or get stuck, uh, Paradise is a place where they get stuck. I don't know if they get stuck in Kiev or not. I know some boys get stuck here with girls, but as far as uh, general population. But um, I'm in front of a Irish pub here, and the consensus is is that the, most of the time the center of uh, universes for expats is centered around the Irish pub. Now, a lot of this has to do with drinking more than it has to do with anything else. And I kind of, I didn't go in here, but... Uh, I just really don't care about Kiev or, or Europe, but I do. I know that some of you think you have to try to have fun in Europe. Um, at the end of the day, when you try to go live abroad and you try to do this, I don't know, peace, love, and pray thing of uh, Julia Roberts in that movie, uh, it's about hanging around with people. And uh, paradise, the paradise place for you is probably going to involve some, some way you actually find a girlfriend or a boyfriend and you also find some people that you can uh, see on a regular basis and make friends quick. Now, being that uh, this is a Russian-speaking country, Russian -speaking country, I'm in the Ukraine, that's a little more difficult. So, you know, you can actually try to immerse and become Ukrainian, or generally what expats do is find a, a, few, uh, a few of their local co countrymen or people from their similar cultures. Like, all of Europe's kind of got the same culture. but. Uh, one way to try to find it is to look for Irish pubs. Um, I personally have not found anywhere in Europe that is really um, what I call a great expat hangout. And I've been to 100 and 105 countries and traveled nonstop for 16 plus years. And uh, I, I would say the easier thing to do is to leave Europe. But some of you are are trying to find your fantasy, find it, find it. I've been in about 37 countries in Europe and I know you're going to come here first and you're going to try to to dig in and try to find something here and this is just a hint on maybe how to find your paradise. 